Alrighty, well, good evening, everybody. Well, um, I thought I'd go ahead and uh, showcase a new team, or I should say, a new old team that uh, that uh, DJ Screw showed me. Um, to, but before I continue, before I continue, um, like usual, I'm gonna be playing some music in the background. Uh, this time around, it's gonna be the Modern Art of Jazz by Zoot Sims. Um, it's one of very few jazz albums out there that's not copyrighted. So I thought I'd go ahead and play it here. So. And I kind of messed that up. Hold on, hold on. There we go. Much better. Okay. So, a little bit of history. A little bit of history. Um, during my stream today, uh, just opening up some guild chests, and one of them, one of them that came up was uh, Shabanu Vespera. So I think uh, the DJ Screw, he um. Uh, uh, he checked. He went on. Uh, I think he went on YouTube and uh, looked for some various content creators that could uh, that uh, you know try to show me some groups. Um, one of them came from a guy named Tacit the Terror, uh, just legendary Gems of War player. Well, oh, and uh, for what it's worth, I call it the Blue Wishes group. Originally, I wanted to call it Genie's Blue Balls. But there's like a 12 character limit on, in this game, so I couldn't fit the whole thing. And I kind of turned this down a bit. Yeah. A bit on the loud side. It felt like I was talking over it. So. But. The original. The original. Co the original. Um. Uh, version of this. Actually had. Actually had Winter, winter Orb. Um, and then, um, I made the class he mentioned was actually Slayer. So, it had the Slayer class and the Winter War. Which, I think, he went with, uh, Winter War because it creates an, creates an ice storm at the start of the battle. So, after... After playing it for a while, um, I thought it to be very, very fragile. Like I couldn't do, I couldn't do difficulty 12, 12 runs with it because he'd get up, he basically get killed in two or three hits. So this team needed some defense. But here, um, I guess since I'm here, let me kind of show you how it works. The goal is to get her up, and then when you do, she's gonna give points to points uh, to a random skill on an ally, and then he, she's gonna create nine gems of their mana color, which it's gonna be this guy here because he's straight up blue, and then she's gonna do this two more times for for random allies. So now I believe the original reason why Winter Orb was in there was because it's straight up blue. So with what I'm uh, with what I'm using now, it's gonna make it's gonna make the structural integrity, for lack of a better phrase, a little weaker, because an extra color has been added. But uh, on the upside, I would much rather have Osseous Tome that could actually blow the entire board. And plus it also kind of occurred to me after looking this over off stream. She's an elemental. As is the two winter imps. So, and choosing elementalist class, he's an, also an elemental, which something like this. One, you're also gonna, you're also gonna create an ice storm every time he casts it. So, I can, you know, I can almost cast this at will. I can have the ice storm up a lot more often than say the uh, Slayer class, which is only gonna have it up one time, or just at the start of battle. So, and then not to mention, this actually gives me, this class here gives me some defense. I mean, aside from the fact that uh, it's at level 100 and somewhere in there I should get a barrier. I only need one single match, so anyway, you know, and then Fortitude, and then not to mention Elemental Force, you're, you're entangling, you're stunning, you're freezing, and all that. So, and then, 
it, I also thought of it too. I think um, the video that DJ Screw showed me, I think came out three years ago. I don't think the elementalist class existed back then. Not to mention Ashia's tone. I don't think it existed back then either. So, this is, I guess, um, Blue Wishes version 2.0, I guess. So, but again, I'll, um, I'll explain more when I do my demo runs at oh, and, uh, after playtesting this earlier, I think, uh, Screw said the same thing. You are going to need a medal of a new in this. Otherwise, they all start at zero. That, that is one of the drawbacks to this team. So... Gotta do a demo on this. Hold on just a second. Okay, so the main goal is you're look is you're looking for you're looking for blue and yellow matches. I'm trying to get him up, but like I said, there is no Mirage Queen in this team, so that's one of the drawbacks, so you're really gonna be uh struggling at first. Fail on blue or yellow, then purple would be next on the menu. And mess that up, give him a poor match. Again, with uh, choosing the Elementalist class and not the uh, Slayer class, I have at least a little bit of defense, you know, shield and entangle him and stuff. Alright, there we go. So, and because they're all blue and elemental, I should, I should be able to blow literally the entire board. There we go. And now, we have an Ice Storm. So, so now the way the way the uh, the meat of this team works. Again, you're creating nine gems of their mana color. So, and two more times on random melee. So you're you're gonna choose probably this guy here at the bottom because I only have to tap up once. And there is a weakness. Again, she's uh she's picking blue. Because I chose the uh, winner imp, but she's uh, she's doing this two more times on random allies. And then, before I forget to explain this again, whenever you have this kind of mechanic, like uh, you know, when you're creating gems of their mana color, if a troop has more than one color, then that color is chosen randomly. So that's why you'll you'll often see yellow and purple mixed in with the blue. him because I only have to tap once and more yellow okay now and these guys are gonna be the uh, the executioners for lack of a better word because both of these guys they gain eight magic on blue gem matches and as you can tell here I'm already about to deal 116 true damage that means it ignores armor um, for a grand total of 148 scatter damage. And then it, it says on the right, um, that's damage that's uh, it's split up randomly between the, all the enemies. So then, I, then I'm also looking at the enemy team. I'm gonna round up and say 100, they have uh, 170 health so by my calculate, if my calculations are right, that's uh, a total of 680. No, 170. Yeah, 680. So what I what I'll probably do is I'll keep casting this until um, I'd say um, till they can deal a grand total of 350. So 350 times two of my winter imps is 700. Should be enough to kill this whole team. So. Got some yellow in there. And more. 
But like I said, this is a weakness, but I would much rather have the Elementalist class in here than Slayer. Especially considering that my Elementalist class is already at 100. So, I think my Slayer class is like 20. Oh, I'm getting there. Almost 300. Ooh, hardly any blue on there at all. There we go. Oh, there's a weakness, but luckily their whole entire team is frozen, so they might get a turn, but they ain't going to be able to do much after. Yeah, I think uh, that, that time I had blue, yellow, and purple. 341, this should be enough to take out the whole team. Okay. Now the other. There we are. So, let's go ahead and do another. And we're at a boss battle, so I can't back out of this. Okay, so... Uh, 185... So I'm gonna go ahead and say the uh, the goal again is to get a total of uh, 700 splash damage. So let's blow the whole board. There's a gem left over. And again, that's another weakness. I have no control over what comes down after I blow the board, so... So let's try it again. There we go. Oh, add some purple in there. Getting a bit messy now. We got all three colors up there, so let me, let me try to clean some of these out. So we got about 200. Should be enough, but before I do, let me, let me clear out any uh, fours or fives I might see. Stop staring at me in the face. <coughs> and I did forget to mention earlier that um I am um uh, I'm starting to get sick. Um, just you can probably tell from the sound of my voice, my throat's kind of cracking right now. It's a bit sore, so... And there's one. And there's the other. So... And then, as far as uh, viability and PvP goes, um, I did a few of them. Now, as you are, against a team like this, no frickin' way. I mean, or Elementalist class, so yeah. Um... Maybe it's I think it's more of a PVE team rather than PvP because once again you're you're starting with next to no mana so you're already having a struggle I mean there's no there's no Mirage Queen in here that gives all your elementals uh starting with half mana or anything so if you don't if you can't get the matches you need right off the bat you're gonna have a problem. So, no 
blues or yellows and not even purples. Okay, there's something there. Luckily, I got my surge. for the moment but on the upside with PvP um, enemies uh, armor and life totals tend to be smaller so I don't have to do this as long like if um, I'd probably say 200 Enough, so let me because apparently, uh, Mr. King here isn't getting hit by a uh, debuff by anything. All right, we got it, and there we go. But like I said, um, I this team here, as far as PvP goes. It's gonna really struggle against these kind of teams. These full-blown, like these, uh, these goblin groups. It's gonna struggle. So, um, I guess the, uh, those high-powered, uh, Zolgoth teams, it's, it's gonna have a difficult, if not impossible, time with them. Maybe. Just gotta not have any bad luck with uh, the genie. Yeah, I keep getting uh, mixed up colors. So, 130, 390, let's say 500. Whoop. Keep forgetting about that uh, spirit gem. Oh, got some burps in there. Let's see what we got. 200. That should be enough. Okay, then he'll do that. And then... That'll do her. So, I'll beat that one. So, yeah. So, I guess. I guess I could do this for a PvP. But like I said, it against the um against like the rural powerful Oh damn. Cinerax. Yeah, let me try this one. get my surge. Yeah, didn't get my mana surge, so it's not looking so good. Oh, there's... So she's gonna get that off, and then it's pretty... 
Luckily, Frozen kicked in. Oh, I didn't know that. So yeah, looks like I'm gonna have to level this up. So now that I'm here, I wonder what she's got. Oh, we got a, we got a skull storm. That's why. Oh, that's donk. snatch victory from the jaws of defeat on that one. And stay away from that. Not sure why he doesn't have a class in there. But yeah, I'll I'll go ahead and do this one and then we'll we'll call it a bit. Oh, promising start. Got an ice storm going. Still wanted enough, apparently. There we go. So, let me, let me look at the alive totals here. Feels like it's gonna suck up a lot of time, but I'm gonna go ahead and grab a calculator. So we got 100, 200, 330. So I'll say uh, 400. Oh, add some purple in there. Any blue in that one. Okay, that should be enough. There we go. I probably could have done that sooner. Remind yourself that overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. Uh, but that's that's gonna do it. I just want to do a little do a little demo of that new team. So, oh, <coughs> oh excuse me. But otherwise, hey, thanks for watching, everybody. I appreciate that, and I'll see you all next time. Bye now.